gonna eat that. Hello everybody, and welcome to challenge number 16. No enthusiasm? You did that No enthusiasm. This, I'm nervous. I'm really nervous about this. Uh, today we have 11 year old beer. Evidently it's been in a, a forgotten fridge in the back of a forgotten hangar for 11 years. Still sealed, cold, all that good stuff. This challenge is brought to you by Sean Hildreth. He uh, he messages uh, he messaged me on Facebook uh, right after we posted the beer video, the two year old beer video, and said that he had this. First of all, unlike the uh, two year old beer, it doesn't feel like there's air. I mean, it kind of does. You can hear it, but it feels thick. That's kind of worrisome. I opened the last beer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? Yes. No way. Oh, it's still got bubbly too. Wow. We're only using two glasses, it's going to count as the full two points, because last time it took us way too long to even out four glasses, so... Do you want to pour it? <laughs> well, Drinking Budweiser out of Miller cups. Miller Fortune, yeah. Blasphemy. Why? It's, it's still got a lot of bubbly into it. It's... It looks refreshing. Is that the right color? I don't. I think so. I don't remember what Bud. Bud yeah, was. I haven't drank Bud Heavy since I was a teenager. I didn't even smell it yet. It. I, it smells normal. Wow. I, Budweiser. What did you do? I created a miracle beer. <laughs> Are you actually going to taste this one or are you going to chug it again? <laughs> I'm going to chug it. Well, for you guys, uh, I'll take a sip first. Just because I didn't taste the last one. Well, I mean, the aftertaste I definitely tasted. But... There we go. So there's that. Um, we'll, we'll put a picture right here of the date on the bottom. 04. Sep or, sorry, excuse me. August, August 9th of 04. <sighs> uh, it smells like, normal. well, no, to me, like right now, it smells like a cider, not a beer. Hmm. Yeah. All right, well, cheers. I'll take my sip. What? What? I haven't had Buddy Heavy in a while, but it tastes normal to me. I taste nothing. Well, okay, there's a little bit of aftertaste, but it's... I don't know. Hmm. I really don't want to put this in my body. Well, I'm starting to, like, you know, um, Coors Light has almost an expiration date and stuff. Bud Light, they always put on a born date, and it, uh, don't drink this after 180 days. Well... 11 years later, I still doesn't taste bad. Yeah. You know? I still can't do that. <laughs> them heart, them uh, hearts of palm are coming back up. Ooh. There's just, there will be a certain point that I will refuse to drink an aged beer, but that's not because of the fear of the beer going bad. It's I know that aluminum will corrode. Oh good call. <laughs> so I that would be a huge fear for me. Looks okay in there. I hope so. I see a black spot on the right bottom. <laughs> I'm gonna go into my stomach pump now. <laughs> uh tastes tastes normal. I mean uh, uh, like I said I haven't had butt heavy in years, so glad it yeah, it's not 
Not bad. And dude, Sean, you get that eight year old beer. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, you didn't actually mention that yet, but Sean has a bunch of eight year old beer too, so we might have ourselves a party. Wait. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> that heart of palm coming at you? Nope, just the beer. Whew. It wasn't bad. Not bad. Oh, yeah. Um, Pleasantly surprised. On a... I got a burp again. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> okay. Uh. Huh? I should mention... <laughs> I haven't just been drinking that beer though. This is probably not why I'm the only reason I'm burping. But um, scale of one to ten, this is uh, uh, a, a eight for me. A solid eight for sure, I guess. I agree. What did we give the Bud Light? Seven. Yeah, I think it's like a seven. Bud Heavy ages better than Bud Light, or maybe it's just the fact that it's the years in there. I don't know. Oh. It was cold. This one was cold. The other one was room temperature, so maybe that one, maybe that had a factor in it. True. Kept cold for 11 years. That is, still gets me, Sean. <laughs> but thank you. Thank you for that challenge. So, well, we both finished. And that puts Rick at 34. And I'm just now reaching the 30s. I don't know if I'm going to catch you for a while. We'll be all right, though. <laughs> Uh, so it's two sponsored episodes in a row. Uh, next week is on, on Monday. We're gonna have another sponsored episode where we're gonna be eating artichoke hearts. Uh, don't forget, guys. If you if you find us on Facebook, uh, we've got an address there, so you can you can sponsor our episodes. Send us some stuff. We'll and we'll put your name in the episode and all that. You know, all that good stuff. Send us anything that won't kill us. Obviously, we'll eat it. yeah. <laughs> Don't, don't kill us, and uh, our wives will get mad. <laughs> <laughs> well, they'd get rich first. Right, and then yeah, yeah. Because but... that's, uh, that's murder or something. We shouldn't be doing that. <laughs> I would hope so. Anyways, uh, I've got two kids. I don't I don't need to die. They, they need me pretty bad. Randy has a wife. He doesn't need to die. So <laughs> don't try and kill us. <laughs> that may all be cut out, but... <laughs> no. Nah. Yeah.